Well, hello, hello, hello. This is Cardell Williams, 360 Global Business, once again with part two. Uh, the last time I was on here, we spoke about uh, bank credit, and we also said we was gonna talk about bank rating. So you're interested in increasing your business, going to the next level as far as getting funding and understanding these bank ratings and bank credit. Um, of course, I'm here to help you with your personal credit, your business credit, understanding, insight, um, let's go over bank rating. So this is going to be a good one. I've, I got some great notes here for you. Um, the bank rating. So the rating is the average minimum balance maintained uh, in the business in your business bank account over the last three month period. So it breaks down like this. Last time we went over what a low five was. A ten thousand dollar balance will give you a bank rating of a low five. Okay. Five thousand dollars in your account uh, rates uh, rates at a um, a mid four, nine hundred and ninety nine dollars rates as high threes and so on. So, what you want to do the bank ratings? The main goal. What is the main goal? The main goal is should you um, you should maintain a minimum balance, a minimum balance of uh, uh, ten thousand dollars for at least three months. That will get you a what they call. Um, a, a low five. Now, unfortunately, with at least a low five, without a, a low five rating, most banks, now this is most banks across the United States, will assume that you as a business owner has little ability to repay a loan or a line of credit. So let me give you the breakdown for y'all who are taking notes, and this is critical for you. What is high five? Account balance of $70,000 to $99,999. That's high five. You want to get that. Uh, mid fives, account balance of $40,000 to $69,999. What is a high four? A high four is $7,000 to $999. Um, and mid fours, of course, is $4,000 to $699. And low fours is $1,000 to $399. So, uh, so the bank ratings... Uh, the business owners, you know, you as a business owner, do whatever you have to do to have at least maintain a ten thousand dollars in your account over a ninety day period. So the money should be kept there to, you know, to ensure that your bank ratings is high enough to increase the future uh, financial approvals because that's what you want. You want to expand, and each cycle is based on the balance rating during the previous three months. So that's all we're going to cover right now. Um, and next, the next time we're going to get on here, we're going to talk about more about bank ratings, like your phone number and what's your PO box or you should not have a PO box. Talk to you soon. Blessings.